we made our way up these stairs, I honestly thought to myself, how on earth have I stumbled across such an amazing accommodation last minute? Like literally I rung about this an hour ago and here we are walking up the stairs of this mansion, only people in the house. It was just very surreal. River Derwent that you can see straight ahead. The room that we secured would have been like a nanny's residence or a housekeeper's residence when it was run as a as a as a home, as a bustling Arizona home. Garden stucco in the heat. Let me take you for the first century of its life, Claremont House was owned by wealthy and powerful merchants, businessmen, politicians, a captain in the English Army, Australian Test Cricket Captain. Claremont House was a grand mansion located on top of a hill looking down on its surrounding 734 acres of land. Um, it has obviously since been um, cut down in size and it's turned into a suburb of Claremont. Um, but yeah, it's got such a rich history. It was super fascinating to find all of that out. Every step of the way, right here beside you. Every step of the way. It felt like such a Downton Abbey experience, so it was really interesting to find out that this home also, you know, went from being a residence to, you know, during the war, post-war, it was turned into a hospital and then a rehabilitation centre before returning back to a residence. So very interesting that it's so similar to Downton Abbey in that way. It's me and you, baby. Nothing but time and you. And a sweet cool drink on her feet I'll be beside you Every step of the way Right here beside you Every step of the way Every step of the way
up there. And we can't Please. get to it. Every step of the way. I'm gonna tell you that I love you. I know not everybody likes reading the captions of things, so um, after being pretty devastated about not being able to get up to Mount Wellington, we decided to look for the positive, hope that we would possibly see snow at Cradle Mountain later in our trip, um, not knowing that we actually would end up not even going to Cradle Mountain, but uh, we decided to head off and just hope for the best, uh, knowing that um, what we were going to see throughout the day was going to be beautiful wherever we ended up, so yeah. I cannot even explain to you how excited I was at this particular time. Like literally I felt like a six year old kid seeing snow for the first time. I've seen snow before but I don't know this was just so exciting and I think just the fact that there was so much of it and it was just Terry and I out on our own. The only other time I've seen snow in abundance was um, with having little kids. You know, the kids were very small. So you were just very focused on holding the baby, you know, making sure the toddlers didn't fall over into the snow and get buried. And, you know, whereas we were just on our own and we were able to just act like kids and enjoy it. So we did. We are, lakes, we have found lakes. snow, thank goodness, at, is it the Central Highlands? Yeah, Central Highlands. Yeah, Highland Central, Central Highland Lakes. See, this could be a lake right now and I could have just fallen into it. Anyway, so it is, I think it's like four degrees, something like that. Can't feel my hands anymore. But yeah, we found snow! No. Yay! No. <laughs> Look at that salt down. Can I throw it at you? No, it's a rock. Yeah. No, I'll throw it no, at you. I just, I just I'll throw pressed it. it. It's a rock now. Here. I'll just have a soft one. Throw it at your back. Here, here's a soft oh, one. Oh, okay then. It's a rock. So turn around so that I can <laughs> okay, have it. Yeah, the back of the head. <laughs> Let the rock. blind person throw the rock. Oh. <laughs> Should old acquaintance be forgot and never brought to mind? Should old acquaintance be forgot and days of old lang syne? For old lang syne, my dear, for old lang syne. We'll talk a couple of We have snow, snow, snow. And here's a lake here. Little bit of ice on it. The frozen is it? Frozen. A bit frozen. Winter Wonderland. She's enjoying it. Another fun here. It's not quite frozen. We'll talk a cup of kindness yet. For all. It's like no, no, no. You know, no, it's been here today, like we have, you know? No one's supposed to stop and have a run around. We're all tourists.
Should old acquaintance be forgot and never brought to mind? Should old acquaintance be forgot and days of old lang syne? For old lang syne, dear, for old lang Coming up this section was definitely a bit dicey and yeah, Terry said that he definitely wouldn't want to be coming back down this way. Okay, we have found Arthur's Lake on Certa Photo, um, which is very nice, but it was pushing the boundaries with our little hire car, wasn't it, Terry? It's a little bit of snow in the road, wasn't uh, it? Yeah, no problems with it. Just don't want to damage it. Yep. So, yeah. It's very pretty. Very yeah, pretty. Snow on the roof. It's a blanket of snow on the roof. And it is uh, two degrees at the moment. 